Jeffy, you've been doing that for 12 hours straight. We didn't sleep at all last night, Jeffy. Please stop. But Danny, if I stop, then who's going to do it? Exactly. Okay, that's it. Jeffy, I will give you $100 to go shopping, go buy whatever you want. Oh, that's exactly what I was waiting for. Ha ha, I got my way. Okay, now we can finally go to sleep. Thank God. Oh, what's that? It sounds like a lawnmower. Okay, that's it. I'm going to go have a talk with that guy. Hey, howdy, neighbor. Hey, can you turn this off? I can't hear you over the sound of my lawnmower. Turn it off. What can I do for you, neighbor? Listen, I didn't get any sleep last night, and I'm trying to take a nap, and your lawnmower is just so goddamn loud. So can you please just not mow your lawn today? No can do, neighbor. See, I've won Yard of the Year for 10 years in a row. I'm trying to go for 11, what? and nothing's going to stop me from doing that. Yard of the Year? Yep. Well, I see a straggler. There you are, you little rascal. Gotcha. What, what are you doing? Every blade of grass in my yard has to be exactly 2.75 inches, or else I might not win Yard of the Year. Wait, what is this Yard of the Year you keep talking about? Every year the HOA holds an annual Yard of the Year meeting, and I've won the past 10 years, and I have the trophies to prove it. You want to see them? Not really. Oh, come on, let's go see them. <sighs> Honey, I'm home, and I brought company. Oh, good. Some cookies. Careful now, they're hot. Oh, honey, these cookies look sweet, but not as sweet as you are. Keep that up, mister. You're gonna earn yourself a kiss. Well, what do I have to do for two? Come here, sweetheart. Okay. You have to try my wife's cookies. They're to die for. And by die for, I mean from the diabetes. <laughs> I also made a charcuterie board. Oh, you have to try my wife's charcuterie board. It's totally worth the high cholesterol. Oh, Hank, stop it. What'd you say your name was? The name's Hank Huckerdoo, and this is my wife, Suzanne Huckerdoo. And we have two beautiful Huckerdoo children. We sure Huckerdoo. <laughs> oh, kids, get down here. You called me, Father? Did you need something, Mother? Kids, we have company, and you didn't come downstairs and introduce yourselves. That is a hucker don't. So, no TV for a week. Aw, oh, shoot. My apologies, Father. I agree with you entirely, and that punishment is justified. And you know you kids are supposed to be practicing your voice lessons on here, which you've been working on. All right, Susie, like we practiced. A one and a two and a one, two, three. The wheels on the bus go round and round. round Round. The, the wheels on the bus go round and round. All three. How was that, Father? A thousand dollars a week in voice lessons, and that's the effort you give me. You take your asses upstairs and keep practicing. You're never gonna get on American Idol singing like that. I hate my life. I hate it here. You take your tan ass to the room. <laughs> Sorry about that, Marvin. Just a little bit of family bickering. Uh, should I leave? Oh. Let me show you my trophies. Ugh, there they are, Marvin. All ten of my first place best lawn trophies. Wow, that's a lot of trophies. Yep, there's ten of them. I count them every single day. And I'm hoping to get number 11 today. Wait, the contest ends today? Yep, and hopefully one day you'll be able to get a trophy in another lifetime. Oh, honey, you scared me. Time for you to let the bar so honey, you committed a huck and don't. What huck or don't did I commit? You broke the first one. A huck and don't be a potty mouth. Oh, I guess I did. All right, give me a lick. Oh, the lock is. Wait, wait. Well, what is this? Those are the hucker do's and don'ts of the hucker do household. You do want to be a hucker do, and you don't want to be a hucker don't. For example, you do want to do your homework, and you do want to do your chores, but you don't want to be a cheater, and you don't want to be a sore loser. You got it? Uh, yeah, listen, I'm gonna go work on my yard for the competition. Your yard? Well, let's go have a look, shall we? <sighs> Neighbor, neighbor, neighbor. You see this? This is dead grass. Somebody call the coroner's office. <laughs> my grass isn't that dead. Well, you see my yard? It's bright green and voluptuous. Yours is dead and, pardon my French, ass. I might have to report you to the HOA because this is an eyesore to the neighborhood. But I wouldn't do that to you, neighbor. <sighs> I'm going to go finish cutting my grass. Oh, my, my grass isn't ass. <sighs> Marvin, you couldn't get them to stop mowing their lawn? No. Baby, is our grass ass? What are you talking about? The Huckerdoos have the best grass in the neighborhood. Who are the Huckerdoos? The neighbors, and they said our grass is ass. Our grass isn't ass, it's just 
Grass. Well, the Hucker dudes have won best lawn 10 years in a row. Marvin, no one cares that much about grass. Besides, there's more important things to worry about. Look, here, I found some earplugs. Let's put them in and take a nap. Well, I want to hire someone to fix our grass. Marvin, you just gave Jeffy $100. We can't afford that. Well, the Hucker dudes have bright green grass, and our grass is all dead. I want to call a grass master or someone who works on grass to fix our grass. Ugh. Hey there, somebody call a landscaper? Yeah, my grass is kind of dead. Yeah, I can see that. Is there any way you could make it green? Oh, yeah. Yeah, sure. I could put some fertilizer on it, water it for a bit. That'd make it pretty green. Well, how long is that going to take? Yeah, probably a couple months. I don't have a couple months. I need it green by this afternoon. This afternoon? That's not happening, man. This grass is dead. So you can't make my grass greener than that, guys? Holy shit. That's the most beautiful yard I've ever seen. His grass is so green, it's greener than Greenland. Well, it's greener than Iceland. See, Iceland's actually the green one. See, what happened was Eric the Red, he was a Viking, and he got kicked out of Iceland, and he went to go live over in Greenland. So he told people that it was green and grassy, even though it's all icy and shitty. And then when they got there, it was all snow and they were pretty pissed off, but they had to live there anyway. So, I mean, I get why they called it that then to trick people, but it seems like they could change it now. It doesn't really make a lot of sense. Anyway, I'm going to go over there and talk to him about his grass because his grass seems great. Enjoy your dead grass. Oh, oh come on. Ugh. All done. I think she's ready for the competition. Hey, I love your grass. Thank you. It's nice to meet another grass connoisseur like myself. What is this, the Goya grass? It's lovely. St. Augustine. Oh, of course, of course. I should have known. Hey, you see that guy's dead grass over there? Yeah. Let's point at his dead grass grass and laugh at him. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha, dead grass. You should check that grass's pulse, which it, we wouldn't have one because it's grass and also because it's dead. <laughs> dead grass. Someone needs to get a defibrillator on that grass. <laughs> <laughs> dead grass. Hey, well, my grass is going to be better than your grass. <sighs> Marvin, you got them to stop mowing their lawn? Baby, I just got laughed at by two grown men about my grass. I thought you said you were going to hire someone to help. That's who laughed at me. Oh. Well, Marvin, now that it's quiet, let's take a nap. Oh, I just want my grass to be green. Hey, Dolly, I spent all that money you gave me at Burger King on a bunch of food, so now I need more money. See, Marvin, we should have taken a nap before Jeffy got home. Jeffy, stop it! Huh. Listen, Jeffy, I'm tired, I'm upset, and my grass will never be green. You want green grass, Daddy? Yeah, but it's impossible to have it green by the end of the day. Well, I think I can help with that. What? No, Jeffy, don't touch my grass. I'll make my daddy's grass green. And done. Daddy's gonna love this. Ooh, baby, look. Look how green that grass is. Yes, Marvin, it's very green. I don't care. Oh, and look how green that grass is. Ooh. Daddy, I have a surprise for you. Are you gonna be quiet so we can go to sleep? Never. Ugh. Daddy, close your eyes, turn around, and walk backwards outside. Are you gonna shoot me in the head? Because that would be really nice. No. Come on, Daddy. All right, Daddy, turn around. What? Surprise! Jeffy, how'd you get my grass green? Spray paint. You, you spray painted my grass, Jeffy! Well, there was no other way to get the grass this green before this afternoon. I mean, you don't like it? Yeah, Jeffy, it actually is really green, even if it is spray paint. It, it's greener than the Hugger Dude's grass. You, we may actually win the contest. Hello and welcome to the Neighborhood Best Lawn Competition. I'm here with 10-time back-to-back champion Hank Huckadoo. Nice teeth, Hank. Thanks, Steve. Hank, I gotta say, your grass is even greener than it was last year. Guilty is charged on the grass. <laughs> well, Hank, here's your trophy for best lawn since nobody else even tried. Thanks, Steve. Finally, I've won 11 years in a row. <sighs> oh my god, give me that. What? That grass over there is green as shit. What? Good golly, this is the greenest grass I've ever seen. Wait, really? Yeah, I'm gonna give you this trophy for best lawn. I won? Yes, how do you get your grass this green? Uh, well, I, I love to water it, and I also feed it grass food. No, wait just a darn rootin' tootin' second. I say he cheated. Now, Hank, don't be a sore loser. But he did cheat. There's spray paint right here. Spray paint? Well, I didn't spray paint the grass. I'll do a smell test. Oh, I'm high as shit. This has definitely been spray painted. Give me that trophy back. What? You're disqualified. Cheating is against the rules. You use performance enhancing grass. What? Here you go, Hank. I'm sorry I even doubted you. Thanks, Steve. I should have noticed he didn't even spray paint his whole yard. What? You're disqualified. Oh. Howdy, Marvin. Looky here. I'm gonna bang my wife on top of my first place lawn trophy. Oh, Suzanne. Yes, honey? Lay on top of my trophy. Oh, like we did last year? Exactly. Oh, 
I guess I'll never win the best lawn award. Hey there, me and the HOA talked about it, and we decided you do deserve one trophy. <gasps> Second place? No, the worst lawn trophy. We all shit in it. We hope you rot in hell, you cheating bastard. <sighs> Ew, Marvin, what is that? It's the worst lawn award. What? We don't have the worst lawn. Baby, our lawn is covered in spray paint. Who would do that? Right here, guilty as charged. Jeffy spray painted our grass green to make it greener. Well, at least Jeffy tried to help. Thank you, Mommy. At least someone around here appreciates my efforts. Well, Marvin, I guess the grass isn't always greener on the other side. It is greener on the other side. The Huckerdoo's lawn is so green. You know what, Marvin? Take me over there. I want to meet these Hucker Dudes so I can know who you're talking about. Oh, no, baby. You're never going to meet them. They're the worst kind of people. You should never meet the Hucker Dudes. Oh, okay. Well, with that being said, I need more money. Ugh. 